This is News 8 at 10. Oh, my God. That's horrible. A horrific crime in West Haven. A dog set on fire in a beach parking lot. Police trying to track down whoever did it. I am committed to New Haven, and I want to continue the work that's underway here. A fiery packed Board of Ed meeting in New Haven this evening. Supporters and opponents of Superintendent Carol Burks are speaking out as the board considers firing her. I was blocked for about 30 minutes trying to make my right turn coming off of the bridge. Relief coming for people who commute to Sikorsky, a project getting underway to help their bad traffic. Sunny and warm tomorrow. Here's meteorologist Joe Fury with your local forecast first. Thanks, Dan. Hi, everybody. All right. Great day today. Temperature, you know, 86 at Bradley for the high this afternoon, which is just about average for this time of year. I know it was 96 on Saturday, and it felt like 106. Uh, so we improved there, most certainly. 70s at the beaches. The temperature right now, 73 Hartford, 75 New Haven. Nice evening out there. You got the moon showing, and you got the dew point that's not doing too bad. Upper 50s, low mid 60s. And we'll keep the dew point there during the day tomorrow. We are dry with 50s to mid 60s to start the day on Tuesday. And then highs, mid, upper 80s, maybe a shot at 90 inland, and the dew point's going to stay down tomorrow. So it's very comfortable. The rest of the week and the weekend and the eight day forecast coming up. All right, Joe, thanks. We're following a developing story in New Haven. Board of Education members meeting for hours tonight, but still there is no decision on whether or not they will fire the superintendent. Dr. Carol Burks has been on the job for less than two years. Her supporters lining up this evening, urging the board to keep her. News ace Mario Boone is live with the latest on the Elm City superintendent's struggle. Mario. Well, and much to the satisfaction of Dr. Carol Burks' supporters, she gets to.